Hello everyone, Captain Cat here, and I would just like to show a build that I was working on after I got my new Xbox 360. Long story short, got a new Xbox 360 years after my old one decided to crash. I kept the hard drive and the memory stick, so I have all the info. Went and did a bit extra work after I went and uh, got back onto the world. Tried to record this video before, phone did not record it. I just wanted to do a tour of this place. So, I plan on doing a tutorial at some point, but anyways, this is the main room. Uh, I do not, I did not create this building on my own, technically. I mean, I built everything you see here on my own, but the original building was made by a, a, a group of Minecraft role players who uh, did this Five Nights at Freddy's role play for about like eight years or something. And this is the, the latest version of the build. Uh, what I consider to be the official build. Because it ended up, they ended up blowing the place up at some point to go in transition. To make the, the place go and... Uh, to set the roleplay up for a new group of YouTubers who are taking over the voice acting and the, the channel in general. And uh, other than that... Uh, like I said, I'm going and just building what I consider to be the official, uh, the last official set, you might as well say, for the roleplay. And I, I consider it the last official one because uh, the, what I consider to be official is the original voice actors. Because once it went and switched over to being a different group of, uh, like a different cast of characters who voice act the, the people in the in the role play, they really, in my opinion, they didn't do a good job. No offense to the people who, you know, actually did the voices and everything. It's just, I didn't really like where they were bringing the whole role play. It was much funner when the people in the role play just ran around doing whatever they wanted to. They, they sounded like they were actually having fun. Then they added, like, a, a plot to the whole story and it ended up just going downhill. I'm not actually done the, the build here. There's a good amount of missing things around the place. Like, uh, up there, there's actually a supposed to be some uh, more stripes. And um, we actually have an arcade over on this side over here. Where a good amount of things have changed. And, uh, in this room here, there's actually a, uh, a little pattern on the floor in the middle of it that I had to figure out. The funny thing is, there was one video where I seen it for a split second, and that's how I got it all. But, uh, the building goes and continues on a good amount. It's quite a big building, and like I said, they seem to have fun running around it. Uh, but, like I said, then they added lore and everything to it, and they seem to just no longer be having any fun. They went and, uh, switched over to a new cast of voice, act of voice actors, and... These new voice actors, they ended up going and, like I said, in my opinion, ruining the roleplay by going and adding lore and having, like, an actual story into it. Sure, I know some people like story, but in my opinion, the story aspect didn't fit these characters. They, like I said, it was much funner when they were just running around and they were having fun. Any room that I do not go into is most likely just a room that is not finished. Because uh, I'm trying not to forget anything here. And, uh, like I said, the, like, the whole thing about this is that... Uh, I, I was watching... I, I, a long time ago, a while back, when they were first starting out that roleplay... I found the videos, and I wanted to go and just watch the videos. It was nice, it was fun. It was a bit awkward, but it was fun anyways. And I decided at some point that I wanted to build this when I got Minecraft myself. I ended up losing the channel and finding it again years later. But at that point, they were, you know, sort of starting to end already. They ended, uh, they were ending the channels, like, soon after that. 
which ended up being two years ago, and I'd say it was like three or four years ago that I ended up refinding them. Yeah, they ended up straight up just ending the channel, and, uh, well, they didn't really end it, but it's like, Two years ago, they went and switched over to a new cast of characters. This new cast of characters... I probably already explained this, but I can't remember. The, these new cast of characters added plot and everything, and I didn't really enjoy it anymore. I, I stopped watching. I came back recently when I wanted to continue building this, to, and I decided to check up on what they were doing, and they seem to have gone And uh, just a month ago from now, like from, from when I'm recording this, about like a month ago, they actually went and decided to end the role play, like fully end it. Not just a simple like switch of scenery, not a simple channel switch or anything. No, they they straight up just decided that they wanted to get rid of the role play. So I I generally like I don't know why. But in my opinion, like the role play was good. I guess what I guess they just wanted to end it since it went on for so long or whatever. But it it seems like after they didn't get any use of it, they just decided to get rid of it. A few rooms are actually not complete. But uh anyway. Uh like I said, there's they just it seems like after they went and Decided that the channel wasn't used to them, they just got rid of it or something, because... I mean, the channel is still up, you can still watch the videos. The the, the channel is Minecraft Five Nights at Freddy's. The, the, the icon is a image of uh, a drawn version of... Uh, like, a, a drawn-out version of uh, Funtime Foxy. It's like digital, uh, digital art Funtime Foxy. And it's just the head, though, so... But, yeah, they're... They seem to have just gone and not really cared about the they, the new people who got it didn't really seem to care about the role play. In my opinion, the original people put a lot of heart and soul into building the like building the building, making the role play itself fun for the viewers, and. Near the end of it, they ended up adding a bit of lore to it. I I was fine with that, but then they ended up switching it over to, like, a whole new cast of characters, basically. A whole new group of voice actors. Same characters, except different, like, voice actors and everything. And they ended up blowing up this whole building. And mind you, that was when I was currently building it. I was only in, like, uh, this room here at the time. I had, like, uh, the main room... Got it over to the hallway and over to this giant room here and like one of the washrooms, that one. And like a few of the side rooms there, there, and there. And that one too. And Oh, and the bouncy castle and stage and stuff. But as soon as I got to like this room here, they just blew the building up in like the actual role play. And I'm sitting there just watching the video like... Why?! I'm trying to build this thing, and they go and explode it? And then they end up going and adding, like, lore and stuff, and they slowly transition to the new voice actors, and I'm, I'm sitting there just like, Really? Like, th these people had a, a good thing going for them. They had, like, two million people watching their videos, and, like, soon as they went and switched over to these new voice actors, they only got, like, one million per video. Like, one million views per video, and it... It's just kind of sad to think about, because it's like, you got all of this, and they just exploded it. What happens next? You got a few videos of the new voice actors going and doing things in a, a, a whole world that they built outside of the Pizzeria area. Then, the, like, five videos later, they come back, and what they do? Apparently, it's fixed for some reason. Like, not only do they not have consistent, like, not only did they not have consistency, but... They didn't even build it, they didn't even rebuild it correctly. The tables were too small. Some things were a bit too far inwards. Like, I'm pretty sure they had these walls one block too far in. That one, uh, this wall was definitely too, one block too far in. 
But they had all sorts of things messed up. I, they never even showed this room as far as I know. But, uh, yeah, they had all of these things, all of these rooms messed up. They didn't build, they didn't rebuild them properly. I mean, of course, I know you can't go and rebuild everything, like, exact, but you have videos. If I can do this from not even a simple template of, like, an exploded building, if I can do this with literally nothing, then at least with a tiny bit of the building left, you could rebuild it better than this. I mean, I don't, I don't know about that, because, to be honest, and I don't know if there is really any way you could build better than this, other than actually going and using the correct mods that they use to build specific things. And as soon as I seen that they just rebuilt this and messed up the tables and, they, and everything, I just stopped watching the videos. I decided, you know what? No, no thank you. I, I'm, I'm done. I ended up uh, quitting building most of this. I got the, the area down here done before I decided to quit, though. Like, just that room and, like, the little offshoot rooms other than, like, the giant room and back. Yeah, I decided that I, I was just gonna quit. There wasn't really anything that I could do anymore unless I went back to the old videos. And they were just gonna keep uploading two videos per day. What, what was I to do, really? Well, what really was I to do? But, yeah, like I said, they eventually just stopped uploading, and now I'm going back and trying to figure it out, figure out the building and everything, and I plan on going and doing a whole thing where I'm going and doing a tutorial on how to build this yourself, because who, who doesn't want to build a, a place that was blown up, like, 50 different times in different rooms? Well, at least the place isn't changing anymore. That's the one good side about all of this. Place isn't changing. I can finally have a set design for it. Other than that, uh, the original people who did the original roleplay, uh, apparently they went and made a new channel called The Oddities Roleplay, and in that one they're going and, uh, they have a bigger building, and they're going and doing more role plays there, just like they did back in this place. I plan on building that building, too. It would take a lot longer, because the main room in that room is, like... The main room in that building is the size of this whole building. So... Yeah. That's gonna take a lot longer. Oh, and I don't remember if I showed over here in the kitchen yet. We got the kitchen, that's an ice box or something. Like a freezer. Walk-in freezer. Then you got this room. I don't know if I showed it off already or not, but here you go. And if, if you want to, you could go and, I don't know, slow down the video, check out everything that I've done, then go and rebuild it yourself. But, like I said, I plan on doing a tutorial to make it way easier eventually. I know nobody even watches these videos half the time. But, other than that, I'd just like to say, if, if anyone who was a fan of this channel before they went and decided to just end everything and switch it over to a new group of people and everything. Well, uh, th this, this is for you. I'm building this up exactly how it was in the last days of the official... of the official channel, I guess. The official series. Uh, I'm glad that at least someone... Even if it is, I would be glad if anyone just watches the video for going and, like, the tutorial or anything all the way through. And, like, they still have, like, a thousand people watching. I guess they'd probably enjoy this. And you know what? Uh, what I might do is I might go and, like, build all the different versions of the place. Now, that would be challenging, going, like, make the pool... That was here at one point. The place changes a lot. Like, it, well, it did change a lot. No longer changes because the channel's now just gone. Well, the channel itself isn't gone, but, you know, they're no longer posting videos. Yeah, anyways, uh, 
People who used to own this building and basically built it from scratch, they now own their own channel, again, called The Oddities Roleplay. Uh, they have a much bigger building and still uses mods and stuff. And they continue the roleplays that they used to do, so... I guess this whole video was just me talking about how... Uh, it was probably like a half an hour long or something, I don't know, but it was just me running around this building, explaining how... Uh, a, a channel had its downfall, and explaining where, like, the people who originally owned the channel are now, and, like, what they're doing. To be honest, I haven't even checked up on the Oddities Roleplay channel, so I don't even know if they're still going or not. Uh, but I'd like to say thank you to a good amount of the people who are in that roleplay. If they ever see this, if, if the people who are in the original roleplay, if they see this, I'd thank you. I mean, I know a few of the channel names. You got, uh, XX, Darzef, XX, uh, I think that's what it was. Uh, that's the person who plays the main character, uh, Funtime Foxy is the main character in the roleplay. Then you got, uh, the voice actor and, uh, the player for Lulbit was Odd Fox. I don't remember the, um, I don't remember if there were, like, any XXs before that or not, but, um... You can find the link to the, uh, the other, like, the channels, probably in, like, the, the channels option for the Oddities Roleplay or something. You can probably find it somewhere, but, yeah, there was a lot of people who worked on it, and, uh, surprisingly, they were all pretty good at doing their voice acting and stuff, and, you know, if there's one thing that I have to give credit to the, the people who went and tried to continue the roleplay for at least a little bit of time. Those people who ran it for two years. The second group, I might as well call them. At least they did, at least they tried to do the voices for the characters. They tried to, you know, still switch it up. They tried to use the actual voices for the characters. But, like, with their own impressions and stuff. Like, that was... Kind of fun, at least, to to listen to, to try and figure out, you know, their impressions and stuff, you know. And I'd just like to thank the original people who owned the roleplay, and, you know, even the people who ended up getting it, and ending up ending it, like, two years afterwards. To be honest, I'd just like to know why they ended it. I didn't watch the videos, I should probably watch them to figure it out. But, yeah, I'd like to just say thank you to both of them, and if there was, like, there was multiple people who worked in the roleplay, so I can't fully shout all of them out at the same time. Of course, nobody would really, you know, if you know them, you probably, or if you know me, you probably know them already, because they have more subscribers than me, obviously, because I'm a small YouTuber at the moment. But yeah, this, this whole video is just me explaining how the downfall of a channel happened... The downfall of a Minecraft channel happened, and I, I'm here rebuilding it. Who knows? Maybe eventually I could go and... I don't know, continue the roleplay myself. <laughs> uh, that would be stupid. But fun. It would be stupid, but fun. So yeah, I plan on doing a tutorial on how you could build this yourself. And other than that, just to... Thank you to everybody who worked on the, the original roleplay, and the people who tried to continue it. That is all. Bye.